Hello, this video will be an introduction to graphing a linear equation on the Casio. So when I turn my calculator on, I need to go to the menu screen. And I can see that graph is option 5. I could hit the down arrow and the execute key to get me there, or I could simply just press the number 5. Now we're in the graphing screen, and you can see that the calculator is waiting for you to enter an equation for y1. So I would like to type in this equation here. So I begin with 2. Now here's a really important part. You have to use this button right here underneath the red alpha key as your x. The calculator will not accept this or this as the x variable. And then I want to complete this equation with the minus 6, and I hit Execute to store that equation. Now I simply press F6 to draw. Now that probably doesn't look like what you have to graph for your assignments in the course because it's not a standard viewing window. It only goes about negative 6 to 6 on the x-axis about negative 3 to 3 on the y-axis. So to make this into a standard viewing window with both axes ranging from negative 10 to 10, I'm going to hit F3 for the viewing window. And then I'm going to select F3 again for the standard option and hit Execute for the calculator to store that. And then I'll hit F6 again to draw. Now that looks more like it, doesn't it? This is the equation of y equals 2x minus 6, where I have a y-intercept of 0 comma negative 6, and the slope of 2, so that means I would go up 2 and right 1 to find a second point on the line. 